guys know I have a podcast. It's linked down below. It's Nicole Jacqueline podcast. I post new episodes every single Friday. My slime shop is restocked and it is linked down below. It's slimebyjacqueline.com. Hey you guys, what is up? Welcome back to a brand new video. I am literally slow. <laughs> I've had lots of caffeine. It's gonna be a fun video for sure. So I'm currently surrounded by a bunch of fidget toys. So you're probably like, Nicole, where did these come from? So first and foremost, I want you guys to literally get ready because I am going to be starting to sell fidget toys very soon. You guys have already seen my moving vlog where I moved my entire office space into an office. It was my office space in my second bedroom of my apartment, but I moved that bedroom out and then into a office space in a fulfillment center. So that way all the shipping will be streamlined. It'll all be super safe and just incredible and just super fast mostly. I'm going to be uploading a video sharing my inventory haul of exactly what you can expect in my storefront shopnicolejacklin.com. It's the same website that we sell slime, supplies, fidget toys, all shopnicolejacklin.com. That is the official URL. I'm going to also post like restock my fidget business with me and share that whole process with you guys. So lots of content coming. You guys will know when it all goes live. Make sure you follow me on TikTok, Instagram, fidgets by Nicole Jacklin. And then the TikTok is just Nicole Jacklin. I post everything on TikTok under Nicole Jacklin, same as YouTube. If you guys are new here, subscribe down below. I do lots of fun videos on this channel and make sure you guys get this video to 5,000 thumbs up if you're excited for my new fidget toy business. But I wanted to review some really fun fidget toys, but I also want you guys, as I'm going through the video, I want you guys to comment down below. I'm going to actually number them as I go through them. So I'll be like, first, I'll put on the screen one, and then I'll be like, second, and then I'll put two on the screen. So as we watch the video, I want you guys to comment down below your favorite fidget toys by the number I put on the screen, because then I can know what you guys are interested in because I'm already looking at ordering more stuff, but I want you guys to tell me what you like and what you would want to buy from my fidget store. That being said, let's hop on into it, reviewing some samples I received for my own business, but they are like literally full size fidget toys that are quite unique and quite cool. So I figured why not just like sit down, review them, play with them and get your take on them. So that's what we're gonna do, let's hop on into it. I just took everything out of the package before I began this video. They all came like individually packed. They're all super cool. I'm super hyped. So I want this before I even begin here, I want to say what actually I am selling that's in this pile already. So when everything comes in, I'm going to be selling these. These might not be the same coloring. I can't remember, but I'm selling um, rainbow poppets. And then also I believe I got some butterfly ones as well. Definitely got these size, these super large ones in the circle and square. And I have a bunch of pop it keychains that were just delivered. So the coloring, I have some rainbow and I have some of this like purple, blue, white. I believe that's the color combination. Maybe it's even pink, purple and blue. Stay tuned for the inventory haul. I'll be posting the entire process on here and then also on TikTok. So I have lots of keychains coming. And then also I ordered some of this is the exact same one I believe I ordered in a keychain. Really cool. Um, and then I think that's all I have right here. I might've gotten like a spaceship something as well. There's a bunch of really cool stuff coming to the shop. So oh, that was, I'm already, that's a good sounding one. Already getting excited with these. So let's begin. I actually want to begin. I'm super hyped. Let's do these keychains. I ordered unicorn and T-Rex one and hearts and really fun keychains. I literally love the keychain because it's definitely a more rare find. So that was my goal. And I also want them to be like an on the go thing. So they're super fun. I love this coloring. And if you are obsessed with these colorings, let me know down below. If you are commenting down below for the keychains, just comment down below like, um, we're gonna put in the first category all the keychains so that way it's not confusing so the first category will be the keychains and then if you do choose the first category as your one of your favorites comment down below like which ones you like most do you like this this like long rectangle one or this rainbow coloring or do you like this beautiful <laughs> me has i already have an opinion this rainbow or this beautiful <laughs> it's like blue pink and white 
so pretty. And then there is like a, it's a little crab poppet. There's a heart poppet, a butterfly keychain poppet, and a unicorn poppet. So I know lots of options here to choose from, but they're so cool. So let's do a little, let's get the, let's get the ASMR. That's what we actually want to hear, right? I'm going to get them all on their loud sides. I love the coloring of these ones are super cute. Yeah, they're like pops on the go. I like the square one. It's square, These rectangle ones are fun because they really do fit your fingers so well. But these ones are just so, I love the little like shapes. You know, the unicorn and the heart and the crab and the butterfly. They're all just very cool. I'm going to begin with the ASMR of these like long rectangles. Very, very cool. So good. It's very like has a nice sound to it. Love these. But again, comment down below your thoughts on these. I really love. I love the keychain idea. It's a really cool addition. And then this one is the unicorn. So cute. It's quite little. Um, like it's a very little poppet thing, but I think it's very aesthetic and just a really cool keychain add-on. And let me tell you, I have one. I have a unicorn one on my keychain right now and I play with it all the time. It's so fun. We have this crab one. It's just like dainty. It's dainty and cute. We have a heart keychain. Dun, 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 dun. I love, I love it. They're so cute. Oh, love the keychains. But again, comment down below your favorite ones. I just think they're just so like pretty and aesthetic and just like, they're very eye catching. They're super Instagrammy. I have some ideas for like some, how I want to, I want to do like a photo shoot, like, so, like a brand product photo shoot. And I want to show like how, like me in my real life with my keychains on my, on my keychain, you know, riding around at the store in public and you're just like, it'll be really fun to show off. So love the keychains. Comment down below your favorite ones out of all six of, or how many there are? Four, yeah, there's six. Okay, next we're gonna do the giant round. Number two will be the giant circle. Um, I do in fact have these coming, these same exact ones. I ordered the large ones super last minute, but they're very cool. I don't see a keychain on this hook. Oh, here it is. I was like, come on, man. So this, it should come with a clasp. Oh yeah, there's, I see them now. I was hoping. So they literally come already in the package. This is a, a carabiner. That's the correct word for it, if you didn't know. It's a carabiner kind of keychain. I mean like hook, I guess. So it's like a, literally, it looks like an oven mitt. <laughs> it's so cool. Oh, I love these, but yeah, it comes with a carabiner so you can attach it to here. But we're gonna begin with circle one. The circle one is number two. We're on the quiet side, so we're gonna get them over there real quick. Oh, are they? I don't know. Oh, <laughs> definitely the quiet side. Isn't that funny how sometimes the quiet side sounds pretty loud? All have to do with like, like if it's, if it's a more flimsy poppet, it's not gonna be as loud, but if it's sturdier, it's super loud. Okay, now it's time for this. Gorgeous. Oh, it's just so pretty. You know, I love that. Very, very fun. You could totally do the keychain on this as well if you want to make your own keychain, add it on. So that's number two. Comment down below your thoughts on that one. And this is our third option. This is the square large pop, which will be in the shop. Um, I have these exact same ones coming. Oh, this is all on the quiet side. The square one is super fun. I love how large they are because it's like, you can pop it for more than like, literally two seconds and you have still more like surface area to cover and pop as you go. Oh, the shade of green right here. You probably can't tell on camera, but it has this like light minty look to it. Now this is gonna be a good pop, a good pop sound. I can already tell it's gonna be good. Okay, oh, I missed one. 
Oh, there's two. I missed three. Classically. <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's do like two at a time. Three, two hands at a time. Amazing. I just love them. You know, I just do. That's all I have to say. I just have love for them. Okay, next up, this is option number four. I'm gonna call this the Mermaid Simple Dimple. They're different because, as you can see, they're slightly different colors. This one has an orange, this has a pink in the center, um, but they're the same pretty much. I would say if I were to restock one, I would guess you guys would want the one that has the orange, maybe. I don't know, but they're very fun though, and they're really unique. And like, I just don't, you don't often see these. So that's very fun. Okay. These are like such strong buttons, I can already tell. Okay. Wow, I'm kind of surprised. It flips quite nicely because you have the grip of the like top of the tail and bottom of the tail. I love that. It's like you're playing a video game almost has that same feeling. This is so fun. Oh, but they stack. Oh my gosh, they stack so beautifully. Look, oh, can you double pop? I mean, I don't know, we'll see. Oh no, I messed it up. No, you can't do that. I thought maybe. Okay, comment down below your thoughts on these ones with the coordinating number on the screen. I love these, but what are your thoughts? They're mermaid tails. So fun. And keep in mind, whatever you're seeing right now, let's say I ordered them the same day the video was live, it would be three-ish weeks from around that time. I might get express shipping, which is a little bit faster, but it would still be like two weeks or so. So keep that in mind. This is the fifth option. This is like a, it's like a simple dimple pop it wheel. I believe it's called a simple dimple toy, but those are just like, I just feel like the simple dimple things to me are different because they have like a hard plastic surrounding them and they have a harder button, but then this is like fully a pop it. Comment down below like the correct term here. I don't want to be like incorrect, um, but I this is like an all red one. I think this is a kind of like a fun color combination. I'm also going to put on the screen the other color combinations that this guy comes in. Um, like for example, the wheel could be hot pink. For example, which is always fun, um, the buttons could be different too. So I will put some photos on the screen right now showing the different color options. If you're not into the red one, just leave the comments down below. The comment section is going to be where I look for all the feedback. So whatever you want to see from my store or whatever you're like, I don't like that or I like need that, that feedback would be so forever just like, adored by me. So please comment down below your thoughts. But yeah, this is very fun. I love how this feels. Oh, it's super cool. And then there are little like brains like on the um, tops here. Very, very fun. Um, I believe it's because it's like, this is definitely not the same brand. Like it's definitely like a knockoff thing, but the company is Fat Brain Toys that makes these um, simple dimples and it's very fun. They almost sound identical. This is the loud side. This is the quiet side. It's like slightly muffled, but that's it. Oh, it's so cool. I love these. It's just like the shape for me. It's just a different, it's very fun and satisfying to look at. You know what I mean? And then next we have, of course, some pop tubes. Now I have ordered some pop tubes. I've ordered a few of them, but they'll come separate like this. You can order them. I believe I'm gonna have them by color. 
Um, so yes, this is the pop tube that you'll get if you order from my shop when it comes out. You guys know I love the pop tubes. They're just very fun to play with. Um, and then next up, ooh, we have a butterfly poppet. But the butterfly poppet that this one is, it all has numbers on. Oh, there's it's like a calculator. So there's one through thirty, and then there's a plus, subtraction, multiplication, and division. Um, it's on the bottom of it, which is very cool. The numbers they like feel cool. And honestly, not a lot of poppets have numbers on them. And considering poppets are pretty, um, you just, the simple objective is to pop them in and out. It is kind of cool to have the added um, number thing here. These ones don't really stay popped in, do they? They're popping, it must be so tight. Um, I believe I did order some butterfly as well. So if you are like, I want the butterfly, um, I ordered those as well. Oh, so, so cute. Butterfly, butterfly. <laughs> Such a fast flap. Butterfly fly away. Okay, we love butterflies. <laughs> Do we? We do. <laughs> uh, next up, we have this little, this isn't, this is like a squid, right? Like an octopus? Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's like a, a jellyfish. A jellyfish, that's the right one. Jellyfish, super cool. I love the little, oh, this is kind of a cool like feeling. It's like a super nice like silicone texture. Funny how they all come on the quiet side, you know? Like I wonder why that is. And now for the loud side. It's like a gentler pop. Oh, it's super, I really do like the super loud ones that are like extremely like click, like seem to like have a really like loud pop to them, but I also like a lot with quiet ones too. They're very cool. Yeah, I love this one. Comment down below your thoughts on jellyfish. And then next up, we have this little like UFO spacecraft thing it has also a little tab on it. And then on the UFO, there are, um, it's the whole alphabet. And then it's really cool is they put the, oh, that's so funny. So they, on the, on the wheels per se, there are X, Y, it says W, X, Y, and then they put Z in this empty part, which is so funny. They totally could have put like on um, up here, they could have been like A, I don't know. I'm just saying. I love how there's like a detached poppet. It's very fun. And then all the little, the letters, I kind of like when there are letters on them, but come tell me like, what, what are your thoughts on when poppet buttons aren't plain, when they have letters or numbers, or they're just like, have some sort of like embroidery on them, do you like that or do you prefer them to be plain? I'm pretty positive like all the ones I ordered from my store out, like as of right now don't have anything on them because I gather that it's not as like desirable. Plus I was at the store at the like fidget section and I remember someone being like, oh, there's stuff, there's stuff on the buttons. And I was like, okay, so that's not desirable. But I can totally see why, because it just like, kind of makes it a different toy when it has stuff on the buttons. Oh, you guys, this is such a good sound. The little wheels are so nice. Oh. Okay, the train. <laughs> Love, all aboard the Polar Express. 
Well, you're coming? Well, to the North Pole, of course. This is the Polar Express. I'm not a fan of that movie at all. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I think my favorite ones are the little legs. This is very fun. This is coming to the shop as well. Not in orange though, but in like a fun color. But comment down below what your thoughts are on like the, when there's like letters and numbers and stuff on the buttons. I want to know your opinion. And the next up we have this bear. There is, it's like empty buttons. It's a super cute bear. I love this. Oh, I literally just love the rainbow. It's just so gorgeous. Oh, this is literally mine from Claire's that I was playing with earlier. It just got in the pile. <laughs> oh, I literally love how gorgeous this is. It really does. You know, how they make these is they if they make them the same way that you make waffles in a waffle maker, the same way, except the batter is this like, um, you know, wet to hard, like polymer molding of sort. And then they literally press it and then when they press it, you know, it like, you know how when you make a waffle, like in those waffle makers and there's, it comes up the side, like it oozes up the side. That happens with these as well. And there is sometimes you'll see little like fraying on the side. They shouldn't if they're been properly cut, but yeah, they are just like this giant pliable material. It's super cool. But when they make them, they totally blend the colors around. So you can see in your pop it, there's like such ombre -ing. It's like the, the, it just leads, it blends so perfectly because it's how they make them. It's like a, such a really cool process. I would love to, I mean like, <laughs> I honestly have some ideas for some videos, so stay tuned. <laughs> okay, here we go. This is the bear. The bear is like very fun. It's a very, it's like a cute little poppet. Love the bear. Comment down below your thoughts on the bear. This next one is a little bit different. This is one of those like white outlined ones that you can pop um, at this like angle. You put it down and it won't, um, as opposed to these, you can't pop them ground down because it there's not enough room. It's not, um, it's not pulled up off the ground, but then these have this nice like siding that picks it up enough so you can push them down and play with them. I've never heard these pop before, but they're quite common. But this is one that I would love to know your thoughts on because they're kind of a rare pop it. This is kind of more fun to poke by it's like one at a time because it's kind of a different sound. It's, it's kind of quieter, but you almost enjoy it more when you poke it separately because it has kind of like a deeper um, circle here. It's not by itself. But yes, this has like a different sound probably because it's hard plastic. So the sound is going to travel more because it's just like this kind of um, texture, but because it has this harder thing surrounding it, you really don't hear much. It's more of just like the sensation. But again, comment down below your thoughts. It's just so different. Oh my gosh, look. I'm gonna end up breaking it. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like making it unravel, okay. Maybe we shouldn't break them. We just got them. They're free samples. Well, I also ordered from this company um, disgusting amount of money of like fidgets for my store. Comment down below how much you guess, how much you think I ordered from this one company. They sent all this for free because I ordered that much. So make sure you just think about that. <laughs> okay, well, so we've, well, we have three more left. So, okay, so we have last three. We'll begin with the puzzle piece one. So the puzzle piece is, if you order, oh, see how this kind of has some excess on the side here? Pull it off. This little excess is because they're, when they press it, and it up the side, like, swoop. <laughs> um, but, oh, that was on the left side. If you order more than one of these, that, that's the quiet side? Interesting, I love how blocky it is. 
If you order more than one, you can um, put them together like a giant puzzle and make your own custom pop, which is really cool. There's something to, I mean, you can't really tell, but like these are really deep like squares. So there's a lot of really cool sound direction when you're pop popping it. It has a cool sound here. This is the quiet sound, guys. And this is the loud side. So nice, right? The puzzles are very fun. They're like a sturdier texture too. They're all so different everywhere, I swear. And then next up we have this one, the rainbow one. Comment down below your thoughts on this one. Ooh, I'm first noticing this is quite tall. So some of these are quite short um, in the sense of like the poppet pretty much lays like there isn't any um, barrier, like that's gonna lift it up when it's on the table. But this has like probably like like in, I would say this is about like a half an inch on top and bottom. So I bet you it'll make it sound better. Let's get this to, to the loud side. Oh, watch my rainbow finger. Okay, let's do this like this. It's way easier. <laughs> I love the green. Okay, now it's for the grand test. Is it louder? My bet is it'll be like, honestly louder. <laughs> Very fun. I do like how it's thicker. The clouds are really cool. Oh, it's just like a rainbow. Oh, this is so cool. I love the bow. It's gonna have a nice like, gloss to them almost. So comment down below your thoughts on this one. It's a little rainbow. We love that. Last one. Whoa. Okay, hold on. Let's put it all to the other side. My first impression is this is super tough and it's like, I can't even, I mean, I can bend it, but it's definitely, you can hear it. You hear it like the density. Hold on. I can't explain this to you, but it really is. Like, so look at how easy I can just plunge this up in half. This is just like way more malleable, but this one is so tough and quite cool. Oh, that was the quiet side. <laughs> they kind of look like marbles. They're super beautiful color combination. It's like a, red, orange, blue, kind of purple, hints of purple, really cool. Let's hear how it sounds. Oh my gosh, this is so fun. Even this, this, um, the quieter side is like really satisfying to push because the buttons have like a very cool, like toughness and like roundness to them. That makes them so fun to poke. Oh, I love this. This is actually really fun. Comment down below your favorite poppets or fidgets in general that we just reviewed. I would love to know what your favorites are. Is it the keychain? Is it the gorgeous like wheel? Comment down below the coordinating number that you saw on the screen by your fidget toy that I just reviewed. Down below, then I'll know what you guys wanna see in my store and then yeah, we'll go from there. But yes, you guys, 5,000 likes if you are hyped for my fidget store. I cannot wait to begin it. It's gonna be like within my shop and whole Jacqueline website. So it's like the same website, but a different like section if you will <laughs> so yeah i will see you guys with a new video very soon make sure you guys stay tuned for youtube turn that bell on on youtube right now because i will be posting the inventory haul as well as the official restock as we go throughout this process together i am so beyond excited so beyond inspired and i just cannot wait to keep running with this and just literally just it's just so exciting so yeah, you guys, I'll see you guys with a new video very soon. All right, guys, bye. Love y'all.